Nasikira sasa tupiga story kama hiyo siku moja. Eh yes, yes, yes. <laughs> Jesus ni not of the still. <laughs> no, 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 still is no. Still is still is no. Yeah, I'm not saying. So for Nyawire before you tell us your story. Uh, actually it's one of the stories I'm very curious to uh, to just to hear your mm-hmm. journey so far. Because mm-hmm. for Nyawire we started uh, working with her. I started working with her. Mm-hmm. I think now for three years. Mm-hmm. Hiyo tu time ulikuwa unaanzisha, mm-hmm. si ndio? Mm-hmm. Ah yeah. And that time glam by IV was just headbands. Yeah, like, sure. Headbands. Not the wigs. Just <laughs> someone told me they look like panty. Guy Facebook. They look okay. okay. When you are starting. Yaani umeanza hata kuuza tu panty. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> she was like just headbands. like Glamby Ivy yeah. was just headbands yeah. yeah. But now 3 years later, mm-hmm. as in Glamby Ivy is a whole other business. Mm-hmm. Like it's a whole other business. And out of Glamby Ivy, now we have Ivy mm-hmm. Ivy's yeah. fashion closet yeah. which is what I'm rocking guys. And that's mama no apatie ni ni mzuri. So I'm just very curious. No matter my three years, I'm like in three years you've done all that. Yeah. Three, actually not even 3 it's yeah. less than 3 years yeah cuz i started uh, in 2020 yeah 2020 cuz i i resigned my job in 29 20, 20 actually 20 20 january that's when i went to hand over my former uh, employment mm. um, yeah so i think it's 20 20 actually uko mm. mwisho september mm. hapo mm. Yeah. Mm. that's when i started 23 yeah 23 yeah 3 years yeah 3 years yeah so i'm very curious to hear you story mm, 3 years akaanza biashara in 3 years akaenda duka ya kwanza na kama ya kwanza sana nyingine kubwa in 3 years akafungua biashara nyingine ya manguo na wigs in 3 in 3 nyawera please okay uh uh first thing i always say when someone's Uh, sees me like that I always give uh, glory to god i always say it see mimi hata mimi sa zingine i sit down and think about it and uh, i watch how many people have failed mm-hmm. they have started today they have failed tomorrow mm-hmm. as you nyinyi i'm just saying i'm, I'm just giving an example even cuz even some Don't people can't directly just <laughs> <laughs> don't go through it <laughs> <laughs> some people come to me asking me how i do it but na ketina juliza hata mimi ni mimi kweli i don't think it's me yeah. i think god has a ha, had a way of uh, opening doors for when your time comes mm. just happens mm. maybe my time mm. had already uh, arrived mm. so uh, first thing uh, mine eh hey, yangu ilikuwa ghetto si kama ya hawa mm. eh hey, ya hawa hata naona ni a little bit simpler na <laughs> yenu <laughs> container mnapewa pesa yani pesa <laughs> Yes. You're given <laughs> money for free. Yeah. Hey, me I'm given that money right now. Yeah. Actually the other day I was telling my husband if right now I can get someone who can offer to partner with me. Mm. Yaani niweke kama kispa hivi. Nike yani ikwe with everything mm. that ladies need. Yaani ikwe one stop yeah, shop. shop. Yeah, shop. Yeah. I would be very happy. Cuz me I, I love risking. Me mm. nasemanga cuz uh, when I started let me not go I I'll, I'll come to that. Before I started I was working in Mombasa at a certain NGO ya watoto kusaidia watoto the the poor so um u, u, and before then I used to work at uh, a certain hotel actually let me start back back my 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 background yeah, yes. background yeah it would be better to encourage someone there so when I uh, I finished from 4 I got a job I received my 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 results then i got a job a friend of of my parents um my pa- my mom used to ask him nikimaliza shule cuz by then we were not my, my 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 dad had already left the job that he had mm. by then he had lost it so my mom knew when i finish seizing here a college direct cuz now there are other people behind me who need to go to high school mm. so uh, she connected me with the with the gen, gent who connected me now to that work. Yeah. So I used to uh, he was working at a certain hotel Sirasema in Mombasa. So I think he was also new there. He was he had just gotten there as a manager. 
So I, he called me na kauliza my mom if I'll be able to move from Nairobi to Mombasa. Yeah. And it's a yani I was 19. Ana niuliza ni move from Nairobi to Mombasa. Yani uko kuna nasikia anga you when you go in there it's easy. Kutoka <laughs> Nairobi. <laughs> and I don't know anyone there. I don't have, okay, I had uh, my auntie there but I didn't know her that much. Mm. So I don't know where I'm going to live. I don't know where I'm going to start. Mm. So What but you just were you doing that? Uh, I was uh, I started as a waitress because now you need to see I'm just from high yeah, school I don't know anything else yeah. so I went I uh, started as a waitress nika endelea nikafanya kama nika kwa kama cashier at times I would even move to the kitchen when there is there are less people there naenda tunatengeneza hamburgers na pizzas evil so I was all over actually even at my place of work I I, I think I was into it because now I knew After, if i leave this job where will i go yeah. so i and then i was so i was so i i think i was a nini a church person so much i depended on god so much mpaka mm-hmm. namuongelesha namwambia mungu keti hapa chini sasa tuonge so if i fail on this ujue mm-hmm. si mimi nitakuwa ashamed mm-hmm. you'll also be ashamed because the people who are watching me and they know i know you and i and i say about i talk about you mm-hmm. obviously hata wewe atashangai wewe ni mungu gani wewe mm-hmm. During my 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 work there I joined college at Tum I did a BA I finished I used to work uh, till 12 at times AM AM at yeah. night AM midnight yeah, yeah. so kulikuwa na bus a bus a matatu that was taking us from now from a uh, place of work ana tuzungusha sasa wewe ukiwa mwisho utafika saa 7 and then in the morning you are supposed to be in class by 7 Yeah. When I finished that year, the next year, uh, the following year, sorry, I I nini, I applied for another the NGO job which I I got. Uh it was under a church. So I got the job and started. And we continue I think I worked there for four years. Mm-hmm. After four ah. years, now that's when I I met with my hubby. Mm-hmm. Uh I got married. He was working from here in Nairobi and I was working he was from here in Nairobi. Mm-hmm. So the, at some point I had to move. So mm-hmm. when I, I I got pregnant and uh, now came for my, my maternity leave. So my intention was when I come to for maternity for my maternity leave I go back to mm-hmm. my to my job I report back. Yes. But now I said my 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 uh, my, my best my best maid akaniongelesha akaniuliza Yani you are sacrificing your, your marriage and your your daughter mm-hmm. in relationship with the dad <coughs> kwa kazi ni pesa ngapi unalipwa mm-hmm. <laughs> cuz now i have never lived with him even mm-hmm. jo- during our relationship mm-hmm. in marriage we've never cuz after one year now that's when i got uh, pregnant mm-hmm. we've never lived together you don't know each other that much you've mm-hmm. never lived together so ni mimi nilikuwa nataka kuka at least me feel eh i'm married mm-hmm. <laughs> so that's when i decided actually it was one month to to reporting time because now I, i i was supposed to report in january 2020 so mm-hmm. instead of reporting i had to give my my notice your mm-hmm. resignation yes. mm-hmm. uh, mm-hmm. uh, that you kizungu hiyo so <laughs> I resign and then in Jan I nika 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 nini nika kaya help I am not talking No that's so <laughs> nika resign I I ni lienda nika resign na kaniru akani nini akanipeleka mm. nika handover So after that when I came back I mean nilikuwa na cause resigning it's not easy it's not resign so. job mm. it's not easy especially if you're used to your own money mm. And then I've never lived with he, this guy together. I don't know whether he'll accept. Okay, I know he wouldn't not give me money. He would not give, refuse to give me money. But now I've never lived with him. And how now? Housewife, I'm not used to that. I have <laughs> never imagined myself being a housewife. Yeah. So I had to 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 plan or doing something that will really will give him even 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 it's 200 and in a day i'm a k per per month mm. bora tu ni pesa yangu mm. so that's when i started now scrolling sky scrolling kikuyu in me has come out hey. <laughs> scrolling down the 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 social, the social media pages they are especially facebook by facebook by then was the, the one that was so active mm. people were so active on facebook 
So ndio nika nikaanza ku scroll, nikaanza kujiuliza what am I going to start selling. That's when now I came across my my in-law uh, assist a cousin to my my husband. So ndio akani alikuwa na anauza nguo, she was a uh, selling from Isili mm. so not like yani alikuwa na anapata ana order yeah, okay it goes like this in Isili kuna shops kuna stores so hizo stores wenyewe wanakuanga na whatsapp groups mm. so when you go to buy something or when you're going to get some things to resell they give you uh, you give them your, your your whatsapp number they add you on their whatsapp groups and then from there now when they when they post you pick those photos you post on your status mm. your whatsapp status or facebook or where you you want to post them mm-hmm. so that's what she was doing so when she gets an inquiry or uh, someone who is interested mm-hmm. she would pick that she would ask now she'll go to his link get the item and now take to the client so that's how she, now i started doing i started doing mm-hmm. that so uh, I, i went to his link go the the nini the suppliers or uh, who are selling shoes mm-hmm. i mixed everything shoes sneakers mm-hmm. easy via to za wasichana mm-hmm. mama anguo kila kitu i used to na sasa hii mtoto wako i think 5 i st- five, 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 six, seven months 5 mm. i think six from six months yeah by then covid ilikuwa ishaingia mm. so the my hubby was working from home na si ati amenini mapesa mm. <laughs> but sasa i need i need to do something for myself kwa ile ningemwitisha pesa ngapi angenipatia tu but now you want to Your also own, make yeah. him proud of mm. you asione ah huyu pia eh you are you you know kikuyu men ah kikuyu ladies we are so <laughs> we are so we are so proud we want to to have your own freedom mm. of money mm-hmm. so nika nikaanza hiyo sasa ya kuzunguka naacha namwachia mtoto he has no problem with that namwachia mtoto mm-hmm. naenda isili na nikipata client that is naenda isili na tafuta ngo saa zingine you uh, get a client ako interested in the item that you've posted but sasa unaona sasa hauna store na hutaki kumwambia ati hauna stock ni mahali unaenda isili mm-hmm kuchukua ndio mtumie no you want to show them that you have the stock yes. you actually have a shop maybe you have a store in the house mm. you have the stock in the house you don't want to show them that you don't have the stock mm. so i had to uh, uh, sometimes you tell them you don't know even whether the size is available mm. or it's not so inabidi wende isili ukipata ukipata the client's order now you go to isili you get the item and then you come back at times you might go and not get the item mm. So inabidi mwambie aki nimechelewa kufika kwa duka I didn't know the stock had already so My assistant has sold it I didn't know I didn't know yani kuficha hiyo So um at times you might go get it uh, uh, you find it it's sold out at a, at a certain shop the one that you had seen it's available but now they refer you to a certain shop another shop now where it's available mm. and the prices might be different yeah. now you see you have to tell the client nimeikosa okay una hapo inabidi utumwambie ukweli mm. kwangu imekosa but niko na <laughs> neighbor anauza <laughs> 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 anauza but yake iko juu kidogo na sasa hii umezunguka kabla upate hiyo mm. umezunguka akwambia ah hiyo iko juu sana sitaweza mm. akimaji and you zunguka the whole day mm. jua imekuchoma yeah. umeacha mtoto anakungojea kunyonya yani kana juli sasa hii ni mashinda zote na ziletea za nini na si bwanangu amekosa kunipatia pesa mm. but i never gave up i i don't know i don't know why i didn't give up i don't know because it wasn't an easy job mm. it was hard it was hard na unajua sasa hizi zungo za isli utazipata na everyone mtu amevaa kila mtu amevaa mm. so utapata clients wengi vile maybe uh, deck ndio kulikuwa ngana na more clients because now people want clothes yeah. for the holiday so that's when uh, now kazi imeshika so that's the time that now you can make money so semba ikapita eh hey, nikaona hey, sasa nguo zimekosa kuitishwa azipatikani clients hawapatikani so i had to change to another thing to research on another thing what can i do nione kama ita itanikubali Mm-hmm. So I I went through the social media the through Instagram I used to be on Instagram so much because now I have time mm-hmm. 
Mm. I'm not at work. So um, I have a lot of time to go through the that's when by then mm. you glossako. Yeah, that's how I knew you. So uh Nika Patana na Arabas. You see these are uh, rubbers from Bata. Yes. So Kunam Stiana Ali Kwana Nunua and then she 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 creates an art. Yani she draws them mm-hmm. and ana 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 fanya artwork on them. So uh so client aki anamtumia picha ana anamwambia nataka hii picha ikuwe kwa kiatu kwa raba. So eh nikaona hii these are good idea and I have not seen them with so with then one else. Yeah. So nika nika inbox nika muliza can you do uh can you resell to me uh with wholesale prices mm-hmm. and so that I can be able to to uh, resell again i can i can do that so that's when we i started now ordering from her she was all the way from nyeri so imagine uh kwa kwa pakia tu i used to get 50 bob profits so and i used to let's say like uh, 250 or 350 mm-hmm. so me now na eh nikiongeza 100 sio itakuwa mingi sana you, you see that car can ni ka kuji diminish kaku kujionyesha ai 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 you pesa ni kind tapata client now and, and then you are at that point where unambembeleza every client anakuja on your way mm-hmm. at least one to meuza hata kama ni hiyo 50 bob mm-hmm. ume make you at least you proud you making something yeah. out of it so that's when i nika nikaendelea ku order then nikaanza ku post facebook then with something with facebook is whenever you post something out there ama you start something new inakujanga ina kwa copied na yes. everyone mm-hmm. inakuwa sasa iko all over that's what happened so facebook pia kuna watu wanajua kuchora mm-hmm. ah kana hii this is a good business <laughs> idea <laughs> hii kitu tunaweza fanya mm-hmm. so they even used to use my images ku post na wana post na a very low mm-hmm. price mm-hmm. in a way hata wewe ukiambia client you're mm-hmm. selling at this amount ana kushangai na una kwa Facebook wako na madharau Facebook kai iko na madharau ni matusi unashangaa must you buy from me kwa una post kitu mtu anakueleza like another day uh, the other day i i i i i, I paid for an ad on Facebook ni kwa ni me post kwani kwa ni mmoja experience tuli posting once tu kaacha na Facebook So me nika the other day I think it's a year ago nika nililipa ad ya Facebook in ilikuwa ni Taban I think it was something is was it a bonnet or a Taban I think it was a Taban Hey mtu akaniuliza ati hii kitu hii kitu inataka inaka stalking ndio unauza CD 550 Eh yeye ni Facebook that's Facebook. So that's me. Even you are talking. Yeah, if you can't buy why are you asking? Yeah. Why you, must you, and then I've not forced you to buy. Yeah. Message ku force buy. Um, it's there meant for someone who is serious or someone who is yeah. 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 you know just you only know what. Kutoka hiyo si gumi hata Facebook. Hata saa zingine huwa nasahau kuna Facebook glamba hivi iko Facebook. So saa zingine hata watu uniongelesha huko hata si nimesahau kuna Facebook. Actually you know now they are automatically posted from their Instagram yeah. to Facebook. Mm-hmm. Sasa kama uangali Facebook unapata pata nini watu wame oh, wame ku DM wame comments <laughs> how much how much now how much ni wenye hawana mimi. So I got that. <laughs> Imagine I never I yani singi yangi Facebook. Mm. Mm. <laughs> But I know another conversation. Uh, you do your post, do the ad, yeah. then they start a whole conversation. This in your your ad, your, 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 your service. Yes. Wengine wanajimake through your ad. I can give you this 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 price. Me me I me nika give up on Facebook. I they don't I don't check Facebook. I don't I don't. Sorry to the people maybe who are watching and they have ever DM me on Facebook. I I how much? Kai ni wengi. Wengine wanasema mkia bwa price for this. Yeah, because now you are not answering. But like the other day I saw some people nini are talking badly of me because now I'm not on Facebook so I'm not seeing their questions and their DM. So CG bukwanza kwa comments. Mm. CG because I'm not there. Mm. Sasa wanafikiria 
<laughs> kazi anasema kazi yao hawa ni kupost <laughs> Why are, you know, why are you posting if you're not yeah, selling yeah. you know mm-hmm. i didn't know actually me nikwa nishasa how niko na facebook page mm-hmm. i see kupenda cuz now i went through those comments i answering them mm-hmm. later so uh that's when now i eh? Wewe yeah, wasa sasa umekopi. Eh wewe na ni nikaboeka. Eh yeah. nikaboeka nikaachana. Ah mimi nikaboeka nikaachana. And then I like something unique. I love things that are unique cuz those are those those are the things that will give you nini sales. Yeah. So mimi nika ah, nikaachana nazo cuz wanauza yani bei. Yani wengine wanafanya <laughs> wanauza unashangaa huyu ana make profit kwa <laughs> yama. Yeah. Ana the it for fun ama huku. <laughs> Maybe to spoil the situation. There are people who out there imagine they are doing that <laughs> to business people. Especially, yani mtu anapost tu na bengine. Unashanga, what's wrong with that? Yani they are not seeing um, their business in future. Yeah. Mm-hmm. They are just here. Mm-hmm. Wow, bora tu wako hapa watashite. They make their money for today. Yeah, for today. Mm-hmm. They are not seeing mm-hmm. the future. So, that's when uh, now I stopped. Mm-hmm. Then I started, uh, hey, young me, long, hey, long. Mm-hmm. Yangu ni long. So uh, that's when I started na uh, now uh, selling. I, I went to through Instagram again. Then I used to see uh, the white people cuz now cuz of their hair nilikaona wengi wanatengenezanga hizo headbands, mm. the headbands. Mm. So I used to uh, to 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 wonder where can I get such a material? Fabric mm. stretchy yenye naweza kutengeneza hizi vitu. Hizi vitu zinakaa unique and I've not seen them here in Kenya. So and uh, I have realized uh, the moment like I view her page I get recommended to mm-hmm. other pages like hers mm-hmm. yeah. so that's when I got a uh, another page from now Kenya that used to sell the headbands and I saw ah nice so there is someone who is selling this uh, this kind of things here so I DM'd her too because now I don't have this the nini the 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 the, uh, the idea of where i can get mm-hmm. the, the the fabrics mm-hmm. so i asked her whether she can resell to me on wholesale na akakubali so tukaendelea hivyo but now it li- reached a point atuku weza kuendelea so i had to look uh, another means ya ku ya kunini ya kujitengenezea mimi mwenyewe yeah. so that's when i started now bringing the fabrics na jikatia mwenyewe he i used to sleep at 3 am 3 am na sayo niko na mtoto i used to sleep at 3 am cutting the fabrics cuz now I, i love doing yani ni kama vile tulikuwa tunakuuliza how do you manage to hand over your 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 page or your business to someone else mm-hmm. so i me i always uh, think when i'm doing it myself mm-hmm. i'll do it perfectly mm-hmm. more than handing it person. over to someone mm-hmm. else of which i think that mindset should change so yeah. yeah so that so i started cutting the fabrics uh, i had to teach the fundi mm-hmm. on how to make them so nikamfunza akajua so now i used to cut them na mpelekea anatengeneza na mpelekea anatengeneza sasa that's now how glamba we started mm. uh, actually i started as i uh uh siju ni kwa najita just something collection glorious i started as a glorious collection yani mtu change una change majina yani so many times au naona hii hii ni kama ni kama hivi kika so much acha ni change to another different name that hii inaweza hii hii client akiona ataona niko serious una change to another name hivyo hivyo so i changed from glorious i used to sell the rubbers and the clothes from there then ikafungua sasa another backup page ya sasa headbands mm-hmm. a different one because sasa hii ni ya ni ya rubbers na nguo na yeah. hizo things so i had to open for for headbands nikafungua eh nikaona hii headbands imeanza kushika nikaachana na hii sasa hii <laughs> <laughs> sasa ndio nimerudia juzi for clothes because oh, nguo pia okay. si rahisi si rahisi mm-hmm. nguo by the way you have to be you have to make something that is very unique mm-hmm. and uh, lovable to clients mm. and also i realized i think we'll come maybe we'll, i don't know whether we'll have another mm. yes mm. yes yeah, we'll come to that thing yeah. i think acha nifike hapo nimeongea sana mpaka kichwa kwenye wajiko ni wazi yeah it's very interesting 
interesting. Because yeah. you're interesting. she's the first person when you li nini uli ni peanga. Mm. That was the first time I was seeing those bands mm-hmm. for the very mm-hmm. first time. Mm-hmm. Uh, then all of a sudden now they are all over the world. But Kenyans are copying. Yeah, it's street for one business. So so bad ni kuari. Copying it's not bad. Yeah, copying is okay. Yeah, it's okay. okay. The market, mm. yeah. Because even me, I learned it from somewhere, someone else. Yeah. Ata yala anasema kala bda i I copied. But now, na ukari buso. Imagine si kuari. Ata I'm higher than her. Labda na sema gai. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I I feel like one thing that was common to the story mm. is that by the time the business was actually starting, mm. there was so much activity yeah. before. Oh, yeah. yeah. So much activity of trying things, mm. yeah. maybe second guessing every step. Try yes. and better. Mm. Like, eh, yeah. mingi, but yeah. before someone actually starts, yeah. Yeah. they actually started, like really started a long time yeah, ago. Yeah, the mm. started way before. Yeah, the yeah. process is always, I don't know. We have to I think we don't share enough about before the starting. Yeah, yeah. sure. Mm. Like yes. what built up the momentum mm. to it. And mm. Yeah, I think it was and great to hear. See, by the way, mm-hmm. uh, you see uh, someone thinking that you uh, you just started the way from where you are right now. Yes. So they start. Uh, I'm not saying I'm, I won't use the word copying. Mm-hmm. They 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 kind of think if they start they start the same thing as you, it will just pick the yes. same way as you as has. Mm-hmm. But they don't know where you you started. Yeah. There is a journey <clears throat> before you get where you are right now. Yeah. So. Um, see, kila kitu. See, as you know, Judy, and now za, and now za makeup. Ama now za nyuele. Ama now za something else. You know, and and do well in it. At ni fikiri even me. I, okay, I might try because mm-hmm. I'm interested mm-hmm. in. Because even me, I had to to see it from somewhere so that mm-hmm. I can get interest. Mm-hmm. I can be interested in it. Mm-hmm. You have to to try first. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But okay, jari fail. Mm-hmm. Don't give up. Keep on so trying keep other things. Yeah. Keep on trying. Just a very good one. You as there was a backstory. Mm-hmm. Well, even us, there was a, a slight backstory when you mm-hmm. But now you see, for us, we felt if Judy can sell for you, mm-hmm. now pay your feedback, mpaka umendo kafungwa duka. So we felt we can do it. Mm-hmm. Because you guys come to us yeah. for you guys to sell. Not, not necessarily. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, if you not, not everyone. Mm-hmm. So I want to know how is your, how is because you, how is your social media? Yeah. Yeah. How like what impact? Because you've worked with influencers, mm-hmm. you've done it before. What is the like social media na influencer? Kwa nini inakusaidia na Judy? Na Judy ye na yake tunastraku. And she's the you, you get my, my own yeah. business. I don't yes, think so. I, do you think they struggle? Exactly. Right? I don't, I, no, I don't no, think you no, guys struggle. I feel like you beat too like Muliuma too much to yeah. chew. Yeah. Na mkajipea very quick timelines. You also have to be realistic. No, sometimes actually. Yeah. I feel like okay, me personally. Sometimes I'm too realistic that in a way I start becoming pessimistic. Mm. When I when the clinic started, when the dental practice started, in Feb, I didn't expect to make any money in f- three months. Mm. Like I went in prepared to not make money. Yeah. Because I'm mm. like, mm. I'm just starting. Mm-hmm. It will take yeah. time mm-hmm. for people to even learn about this clinic. Mm. Like I am so realistic. Sometimes it's pessimistic. Mm-hmm. So I went in prepared for three months of no income, no revenue from the business. Yeah. Mm. You guys went in. Hey. Hey. <laughs> optimistic. Yes. Yes. Your optimism <laughs> was bordering. What can I say? You are so optimistic. Just, just <laughs> call it whatever you Anyone. want. You are so optimistic. Mlikuwa de lulu sana. Like, yeah, that's hey, your delusion was. That's the word. <laughs> container, container in six months. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Like, I feel like um, in whichever business someone tries to do, mm be a bit realistic with it mm-hmm. because you've known people who've done it mm-hmm. before i started my business my practice i was working as a freelancer in other people's practices 
And I would go a day, yeah. a full day. You've not seen any client mm. and you've gone home, but you expect a salary. Yeah. Mm. So there you know that day, your employer is literally dipping through into his pocket yeah. to pay you. Mm. So I went in with that reality in mind. I've also had friends who've started their own practices, but with very, very high hopes. Ilea, I was so delusional. Like, na kifika, and then you don't make the money when you are, you're having so high hopes. Yeah, yeah. Binaza kuku crash. Yeah. But mm-hmm. uzuri, iki crash pia, that's a lesson. Umeona yeah, nyewe, sure. mantua, nimeenda hivi. Mm. Okay, now you need to regrow and know that it may not always be as glossy as I wanted it to mm. be. Yeah, so be a bit realistic and for timelines that actually make sense mm-hmm. with learning from people who've done it before you. Yeah. 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 The good thing about <coughs> nowadays is me, podcasts. I'm mm-hmm. learning so much from podcasts. Yes. When you listen to someone's story of how they started, mm-hmm. it always hits you that they didn't just wake up and make it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like that journey, if you listen to it and actually be open to learning from other people's journeys, you know that things are not fast, fast. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You guys are okay. You guys can say. You've sold our business. Yeah, yeah. 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 I think part of it is what she was mentioning and Mm -hmm. that's what I'm learning. Uh So I sell consumable goods. Mm -hmm. So that means in a way, like resale is kind of already built into the business. So revenues automatically would be higher than if it's something you buy once and you Mm -hmm. don't come back. Mm -hmm. So I think that's another thing with household items. Mm -hmm. Aitaisha. Like Mm -hmm. you can only send me one item and unless you send me something different, I can't Mm -hmm. buy something else. So I think it was also the variety of things being sold. Mm -hmm. Like if you're started small, you'd have become strategic about knowing Mm -hmm. this moves, this doesn't move. This is where there's interest, this is where there's Mm -hmm. no interest. Mm -hmm. So if you had that research beforehand, you'd have been able to fill that container with things Mm -hmm. you can move in six months. Because I don't think it's that you can't Mm -hmm. move the volume. I think it's the items that you are selling. (laughs) If we switched off those things for like a hair oil, mm. Gemaliza. Yeah. yeah. Gemaliza, by the way. True. I think yes. it's what she Actually, mm-hmm. that's very true. Because even mm-hmm. from the, we had like 15 products in mm-hmm. that container. And out of the 15 products, we had like our best sellers. Mm-hmm. Chopper, the mm-hmm. dispenser, mm-hmm. the water dispenser. Like mm-hmm. we had three things that were best and those ones sold out. So, so fast. fast. Yeah. So fast. Like See? so fast. Mm-hmm. The next container? Now we do that. And they were in thousands. <laughs> they were in thousands. Yes. 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 Like for the chopper, you had like 5,000 pieces. 5,000 so chopper. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. <gasps> now you so see, loud. when uh, I think uh, when when you when you get something new and then you see it moving so fast because I'm I'm see I've seen it uh, in uh, with the the two pieces the mm. prints mm. so uh, if you bring that uh, two piece or maybe a certain uh, color of a uh, dress mm. you bring it and then then it moves so fast mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. so imagine that destroys the the, the morale of the clients. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Ufai kurudisha. Let them put ne watch your kayapu kwa. How do I put it? Yeah. Yes. Bring something new. Yes. Don't bring the same same thing mm. because you've seen it move so fast. Mm. That's what I've learned, especially with the with the clothes. Mm. Don't if you if you you've brought something and it has moved so well. Mm. Just bring something new. It keeps the clients yeah. flowing mm-hmm. and uh, motivated and yeah. always uh, glued on your page mm-hmm. to see what is new, what is mm-hmm. new. But if you keep on posting, because how na image zingine, you keep on posting the same, same thing, the same, same thing. I actually even go get bored myself. That's mm-hmm. I get bored. And then another thing, if uh, uh, having a social media page is uh, very important nowadays, especially nowadays. Because mm-hmm. now, uh, you can tell me to leave my house and go uh, in town mm-hmm. at inaenda kuangalia certain, uh, at a certain item, a certain cloth, mm-hmm. and I don't know, I have got no any, no idea mm-hmm. where I'm going to buy. Mm-hmm. So you have to search first on Instagram or Facebook. Ndiyo ujue, maali unaenda. Mm-hmm. So you know exactly where you're going. Because mm-hmm. uh, I'm sure where you're going, there are other shops that are selling uh, similar, similar items. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So that's where you'll get the idea from. So yes, yeah, having a page, especially on Instagram, it's very... Okay, we have to open Facebook. Because they are connected. They are connected. Mm-hmm. But Instagram 
with their, their very serious clients mm. on Instagram. Mm. Mtu wa Instagram hayezi kuja kukuchezea. Mm. When That's they DM true. you, when they call you or they WhatsApp you, they know what they want. Mm. They can't DM you without knowing that they they they, are, they, they don't want to buy that item. Mm. They are very serious. Mm. Actually Instagram they are, <laughs> when when you <laughs> Instagram is full of uh, potential and uh, serious mm. clients. Mm. So uh, having a social media platform mm. ama instagram page is very important because mm. nowadays i kila kitu ni online yeah, yeah. 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 i think yeah. Yeah. touching back on something she said creating that even if it's an illusion mm-hmm. of excessive demand mm-hmm. so you even say they are sold out yeah. Yeah. Kwa nyumba. Yeah. and then in two weeks mm. msema sir they've been yeah. restocked yeah. don't miss yeah. out yeah. Oh, yeah. that's those my yeah. 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 it's I've really that reason actually yeah. 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 Tulifanya nini? Tulifanya sale kila time tuna. What are you doing? Alafu another thing. Yeah, say it. Say it. Say it. No, no, no. But it's not bad. I don't know why it's bad. You get it. I realize. Hiyo kuweka sales kila saa. It's bad. It's damaging. But it's very damaging. It's very damaging. You rather sell something. You bring something uh in a small quantity. Use it. Yende ishe, mm. then bring more, mm. then, then make a sale. sale. Yeah. Okay, you learn. You have to learn from somewhere. Yeah. Mm. You have to start from there. Mm. But after learning, don't do that again. Mm. Bring. Ah, uh, come on, easy. Me, me, sile tanki pieces mingi. I bring like maximum twelve or twenty. Mm. Zikisha ni ba. Zikisha. I bring you another. Even if it's available yeah. from them, uh, from where I get them. Mm. I don't buy it again. Mm-hmm. And as a customer, mm-hmm. I feel good. You stuck it to jail. Yeah, yeah. 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 that's a that's a good way. Yeah. 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 Six months yeah. later, you're still selling something that I bought. Yeah, yeah. yeah. that's true. Mm-hmm. But the oh. current Kenya uniforms are not bad, you guys. Mm-hmm. The current Kenya uniforms. Zico. 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 Iyo, he, like, oh, this, this, oh. this, like this is a current Kenya uniform. It's a little different. The the, the pants sets. Like the pants sets, oh, the yeah, shorts. Oh, yeah, the current. Uh, but are totally different. Like the set, really different. They're so many yeah. different designs. They're really good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they're good. It's a good yeah. Kenyan uniform. Mm-hmm. <laughs> as as we try and wind up, because we have to and wind up. Mm-hmm. Otherwise, we'll be able to get back to each other. I don't know. I feel like we need, I need to bring you guys back. Mm-hmm. And then we just continue this conversation because mm. for me um i would my actually this is my honest question and the reason why i thought i need to have this lady sit here with me you do one is idea of career so from our story with uh, mama Tungi, mm-hmm. Uneza, i know you've touched because i think dr wanza mentioned a few things that mm-hmm. she thought we did mm-hmm. that made the business maybe not very successful mm-hmm. but if um for we were planning to come back Yeah mm-hmm. you said we are not uh dreams are still very valid we are not valid. giving up so as we plan to come back what piece of advice mm-hmm. do you have for us because we want to revive the business as much to rudy for get serious i think i think you gave up so fast after two years <laughs> yeah, you did you did because <laughs> that was the first business that you started right and yeah. it failed right i actually the one that didn't fail failed, actually didn't mm-hmm. fail because you sold done. down the stock yes you sold hey, it didn't fail yeah. you're the ones who are saying it failed mm-hmm. but imagine you never failed you then you gave up i think too easily ama you had mm-hmm. so much any moral ama you had so much the way she said mm-hmm. hope like the hope Yeah. Uka kwa muka kwa crashed hey, at yeah. once. I think that's it. Yeah. yeah. So you made it quite fair. Yeah. You still made profit uh, in the, after the two years, so, right? Uh, no. Huh? Oh, that's oh, okay. Uh, even if you did, no even if <laughs> like me in six months. In six months to make profit. If, if you had done it in oh mm. but at okay. least you, you 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 see like me uh nimewaelezea how how high, how, uh, how many times i started fail started mm. changed started mm. but sasa nyinyi mulijaribu just once once mm. and uh, within two, so those two years you didn't introduce anything else mm. new mm. so you just gave up hii hii hapana hii hatuwezi na mka give up kabisa no we are coming back so we need to come back so when you at least you've learned le- yeah. 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 some lessons yeah. you have to you have to start somewhere mm. by the way you have yeah. to start even mungu haizi kuletea tu baraka tu pavu mm. at ndio hizi hapa chukua no you have to learn your lessons so that those lessons can help you build yourself well in future and also have a story to help someone else Because mm-hmm. now if we didn't go through some things we wouldn't be here. 
hata si kikuwa na story mm. ningekuwa sana nime hata ningekuuliza sana ndio kuja kufanya unless ni create uongo of, mm. of which now i don't think that would be a good idea yeah. so you have to learn from somewhere mm. and you have to start from somewhere mm. and the best way to start a business ama something it's mm. from there yeah cuz when it grows you'll be able to maintain it you'll be able to value it mm. and then as you start those different things you'll you'll learn to know which business or which type of business or which products or which service mm. you you fallen in love with because mm. now you have to love what you do yeah and we are by you knowing what you love you have to go through those things yeah. you learn about that because mm. even in a relationship you have to open dang him to two pap yeah you have to have a relationship that's why it's called a relationship mm. you have to have a relationship so that you can know that person and the love uh, keeps on growing it keeps on on growing so uh, the same with businesses you have to start something so that you can love it because you can never you can never prosper in something that you don't love mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. How easy cuz mm. like me I love what I do I love beauty I love what I do yeah. and that's why maybe I keep on researching more I keep on checking uh, on something some things that are not that are unique I normally check in the market what's what is out there that doesn't have that people need but they can't get it so easily am I it's not all over and that will help help them also mm. so you have to If you don't love what you do, you mm. don't research. Yeah. You don't even move from one to two. Yeah. How na your moral? Mm. So you have to love what you do and by loving what you do, you have to try and see what you love. Because mm. haiezi Mungu haiezi kwa kuja kuambie, "Ah now this is yours. Yes. Ah this one you love." <laughs> even you yourself, you you don't know, you didn't know. Yeah. Even <coughs> men, you have to una haiezi kuja tupate mmoja ati ya huyu huyu ndio nimependa no lazima okay si lazima upitie semi ati lazima upitie hao you have to kiss on you have to kiss on no i don't mean that but you have to have a friendship with them na uone huyu ai huyu hapana acha niende kwa you next huyu sasa ni yeye sasa huyu ndiye sasa so that's how it's it is you have to love what you do yeah si usiangalie kitu huko nje useme ai hii nitajaribu mm-hmm. then ukijaribu u give up mm-hmm. try another thing mm-hmm. try another thing. like if you watch her stories her page you you you'll see yes, the yes. love that yes. is in her about what she, what does. she does that's yeah. true eh, even yeah. clients or other kinunua even if they don't like what maybe a client come you know the clients come that way because mm. they see the love that you have with mm. them so they want to try it themselves mm. so when uh, when a client comes even if they don't like the product that you're giving or the service that you're giving them it's not because that it's not good it's because maybe it doesn't go well with their with their with their with their taste ama mm. it doesn't look well with them it doesn't go well with their look but the 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 the, the problem is not your product yeah. it's the way it looks on them mm-hmm. so ata ukiuza hiyo kitu you'll be so confident yeah. ah hii hii ni kushua bed ah hii mm-hmm. inaenda hii ah nywele hii ah inaenda hii because mm-hmm. i have to love it first even mm-hmm. when you're selling something if you're bringing something new you have to love it first kama mimi kama nimechukia kitu i don't i don't soak it mm-hmm. if i feel i know this one i wouldn't wear i don't sell it So I sell even uh, if that item I see it somewhere else mm. I I point it and I see ah this 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 thing is it's good it's good I love it I'll take that thing and I'll sell it out there but always use a kitu yenye unachukia sure always always so that's why I'm saying you have to love what you do yeah I a few things I think one would be the strategy around the marketing mm. would be different mm. I think you should utilize the background and the context you have to market your products in a different way so maybe for example we're marketing furias chopping board something so you see like how you and team always do skits mm. you can do a skit that's like now mm. in that setting when every time you pass something you sell it dings and like there's a link or something like find an interesting way to position those products mm. in your context because yeah. we love you because mm-hmm. of you know the, yeah. the stuff that you do right like yeah. with the acting and the skits and mm. the whatnot so find a way to 
put it in that context because that's what draws us to you and i think it removes a lot of that like you know you're selling because you have an audience mm-hmm. so you can make money mm-hmm. off of us mm-hmm. and then I think small, yeah. like we'll do so much better. I would mm. take even just one million, do one shipment, bring, sell most of it, restock like that, like mm. that, like that. Mm. Instead of putting yeah. a lot of money back into the business mm. again. Because mm. even when you start small, mm. you feel that pressure of, okay, is it 20 Zimesha? We need to go and buy more. Mm. And you'll mm. always, and adding new things, because it's not a consumable good. So yeah. You have to keep yeah, adding sure. yeah. new things as well. Mm. Yeah, I think that's what I'll do differently. It should be more exciting that way, actually. Mm. Yeah. 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 That's true. Like That's key mission, I mean, that faster so you know you're restocking yeah, that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. 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 Actually, no, that's our, yeah. our, our, our strategy. Yeah. Don't tell them. They but will but see. Don't, <laughs> it is our secret. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> but also, not going to small PR. Yeah. No, 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 this is no, 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 a thing of. This is also a thing of going in too small because of fear mm-hmm. you guys are starting from experience mm-hmm. you did this you saw what didn't work yeah. you've heard from the expert mm-hmm. right here yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah so you're starting from experience I by saying like, small it doesn't mean that she i think what i uh no i meant like saying, the quantity yeah. Yeah. Yes. Uh, the quantity yes. don't talk yes. too much yes, yes, yes and yes. then it will because even you get bored if it you yeah, yeah. Sure. yeah but okay you don't limit yourself on the goal mm-hmm. but the the quantity mm-hmm. what you bring yeah i think that's what she meant yes yeah. i i also agree because that's the biggest take home mm-hmm. like that's the biggest take home we took from mm-hmm. all this mm-hmm. next time we are going in Hatuendi kuleta vitu mingi. Mm-hmm. Sitakuwa mingi but different mm-hmm. things. Yeah, different mm-hmm. things. Yeah, yeah, sure. Yeah, because mm-hmm. even guys were asking, kwani amna kitu kingine? Yeah. And you see the mm-hmm. good thing with the, our investor ama he was some sort of like a mentor. Yeye mwenye anajua hizo vitu. So nikaa kwa sababu ni Mungu alikuja tu kwa mlango. Ni magic. Ni magic. Na kabisha tu anasema I am here. That's true. Yeah. But so, now my final final question for me is you come on to get a kona swali nyingine. Since and uh, mama tu gele kwa me mention a bit up uh, before. Uh, now that you've worked with influencers, mm-hmm. I would just want to hear from you. I know to now get one and be especially my problems when you may pata customers mm-hmm. nini but I would want you to tell us just a bit mm-hmm. about your experience working with influencers mm-hmm. and what it has done for your business. The good and the bad. The good mm-hmm. and the bad. Yes, thank you. <laughs> okay for me it's ba- it's done more good mm-hmm. uh than bad actually there's not been bad mm. there's just been nothing but mm. um it's done more good mm. working with you is i feel like our first interaction formed the foundation of me working with you mm. we started with just stories And you remember it's because you and Mumbu wanted cleaning. Yes, it's something like we wanted to do last year. You yeah. really needed yes. it done mm-hmm. and we started there. It was how easy me I don't like hard things. Mm-hmm. Even in my interaction with my clients, mm-hmm. I like it when my interactions feel yeah, easy. Yeah, very easy. Mm-hmm. I, I I don't like hard. Mm-hmm. So, when it comes to influencer marketing, I need an influencer that I feel that is of working with. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And it came very easily with you. Um I've worked with one where it was very difficult. Mm-hmm. Ah, very difficult. Yes, yes. <laughs> good. Yes, yes. Very very difficult yeah. like, like um dealing with them just as dealing a with them. Yeah. And even in the content, mm-hmm. the rigidity in what they're bringing to the table. Mm-hmm. Um okay, I can also be a little of a control freak with the content, but mm-hmm. that was very difficult and it felt like We have influencers in the market who have potential mm-hmm. but they don't know how to explore their potential. Mm-hmm. I think that is how I interpreted that situation. Mm-hmm. I didn't hold it against her. Mm-hmm. She just isn't trained. We are not sorry. trained. We are sorry. But mm-hmm. no, I, no you should be sorry to the influencer because she's we are yeah. So <laughs> yeah. I, I feel like <laughs> you can see training areas for yeah. young influencers we'll just mm-hmm. for them to understand but when there is some ease of working mm. with an influencer mm. the outcome is good mm. so because this, you may not get sales directly yeah. but maybe your business is at the awareness mm. stage you just mm. want to create awareness about your business yeah, sure. and now working with influencers translates better when what the influencer is selling is what the client finds on the ground mm. yeah sure yeah sure. you don't want to sell um really really good service mm. the influencer talked about your 
like a dental practice being clean mm-hmm. um like you don't want them talking about something that is totally different from what a client finds because all you need is one client yes. to actually report mm. that it's not really like that. Mm. And then that can... The internet is good, mm. but it has its... It can also be bad. Yeah. Yeah. So learning to leverage the internet so that you can harness the good mm-hmm. is like a skill we all need to be taught. Mm-hmm. We're all learning. Yeah. <clears throat> I love that. Yes. What what I'm taking from her mm-hmm. is that working with Judy Nawira as a brand is is the brand is an easy brand. This is an easy brand. Mm-hmm. Like for ground, the vibes mm-hmm. are just right. The vibes are right. Yeah. From screen yeah. to yeah. ground. Yeah. Sure. yeah. yeah. Yes. Yeah. The way you see, mm-hmm. like what you see is what you get. Exactly. Mm-hmm. What you see is what you get. Because mm-hmm. the other That's what you see is not what you get. Mm-hmm. I get yeah. it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. Thank you. Um, this one has not worked with anyone. <laughs> but I, I have <laughs> feedback. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> she um, I consider myself her. that. Um, She's an influencer, so I think for me, I've never really sought out like influencers mm. particularly. When we were young, I would send PR packages strategically to some people, and that really helped like mm-hmm. get my business off the ground. I have mm. to say. So I think for us, what we've been doing a lot is trying to connect to people who are we on the same vibe with, even like brand wise. Mm-hmm. And like now, if you see you've come to us and you love the services and the products, naturally you're already an ambassador mm. of our products. Yeah. So it just so happens you have a platform, and like you also talk about it there. Mm-hmm. Um, it's something that we want to delve in a bit later. I have a lot of reservations about working with influencers. Mm-hmm. Um, one, I think as growing businesses, I can't afford to pay you exclusively at a now if so and so comes, you say sorry, yes. I'm, mm-hmm. I'm obligated. If so and so comes, sorry, I'm obligated. Mm-hmm. Just because of perceptions and some of the things that they teach in terms of because skincare is very technical. Yeah, yeah. If our philosophy is it works like this, but then you know, next month a big company approaches you and you work with them and they say no, it's opposite. Mm-hmm. When you go and tell your audience that, they'll assume that yeah. it's what we've said or someone. Mm-hmm. So there's a lot of yeah. complexities yeah. to it. Mm-hmm. So I want when I start working with influencers now, actually, I want to be able to retain you for two years, for three years. Yeah. Yeah. You yeah. can't work I with anybody that's else. Good, so yeah. that yeah. there's also that every time you talk about skincare, it's beauty square. People yeah. already know it can't yeah. be anybody yeah. else because yeah. yeah. I think that also just affects the way that they're mm-hmm. influenced. But I have to say I'm grateful for those people who have platforms who have experienced us and have promoted us. Mm-hmm. Um, can it's I definitely speak? had a big impact. Yes. Can I speak on that point? Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> no, this one is on a personal level. Like mm-hmm. on a personal, personal mm-hmm. level. Mm-hmm. There are so many clients who've come my way mm-hmm. and they have turned them down. Yeah. Because mm-hmm. on a personal level, like my people know if anything, whatever you see on my face, if I'm doing a facial, if I am buying a, uh, some, some products, I'm buying them at Beauty Square. Mm-hmm. So now if... I start, and they are paying, they are willing mm-hmm. to pay, yeah. mm-hmm. but on a personal level, mm-hmm. I'm just aki up and I'm your audience. Exactly. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And let me tell you, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I can't, like, my, I can't take my audience mm-hmm. for false. Mm-hmm. But you right. don't do that. You, you don't, don't break the trust. Don't you don't do that. Like, mm-hmm. I've had, like, juicy too. I had yeah, a very good, you mm-hmm. know, mm-hmm. like, the same, the same company, I've seen them on TikTok, mm-hmm. even on Instagram, doing, it's similar to Beauty Square, but they're very similar. They're selling products, skincare mm-hmm. products, and they're good. The same products I would find out. Yeah, but I was like, this is mm-hmm. lying to my audience. Yeah. I can't do that. Can't it's money. That. I'm losing yeah. money, yes, yeah. but I can't do mm-hmm. that. Maybe after it's a while lying. now. Not even after a while. Mm-hmm. I can't. I am Beauty Square. Damu. And then you see, where is it? Now, how can you handle it? Yeah. 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 No? Yeah. But you see, at a, on a personal level, mm-hmm. I feel. Napundu influencers to Nakosi Anga. Like Fala. if I was to talk about influencing and mm-hmm. it's like mm-hmm. I've another good example. After I started working with uh, Dr. Wanza, mm-hmm. I think after the first the stories went the stories. Let me tell you, I had like the three stories. other dental companies <laughs> approaching, <laughs> approaching <laughs> me. And yeah. some of these things will even throw money mm-hmm. at you. Like, to pay more. Yeah, pay more. You know, because yeah. but me I believe in please. 
kama nimekwambia na ndanga hospitali hapa kutengenezwa meno mm-hmm. that is where just I go. and i will stick to that whether i'm making money or not and that's why you have the influence you have yeah, yeah, yeah sure it's like, don't influence. don't yeah. your audience they are not fools they mm-hmm. can see these things because even me i can i can't keep on coming back to you to to to, to work with you mm-hmm. if i know if uh, you post for me today mm-hmm. you post for another person tomorrow yeah. Yeah. so that is because uh, i i think i remember when you we were working with a certain uh, a certain uh, page uh, week. company a week mm. ukaniambia for okay for they are not doing the headbad ones mm. we but can it, do that yeah. but for the other ones yeah. i don't think we can do it mm. by then at jai fanya nae we always do for headbands yeah. so she told me and that's why by the i was so actually at away i don't know yeah. do, you, do you know why mm. this mm. thing do you know why she can't mix because mm. even her and her just give yake like here i got help mm. so mm. let me settle yeah. here kwani nenda kutafuta kwa skin care is very sensitive skin care is very sensitive, sensitive. now i got to touch on that now and you see actually people will see direct and they know you're working for me they will never touch my face you see how you lying to people and then she get what show No sita hizi shika. Anasema na sasa wachukue. Eh zende zi wa react. Sasa nitaanza kusema. Actually if I send someone to Kenya now and there is a problem, I know I can call Kenya and mwambie Kenya. And she will find something with skin by the there are some because for clothes we are different. Mm. We are selling different yes, clothes. Hiyo yes, hiyo yes, iko yes, free, hiyo yes, iko free. Yes. But for skin care by the way, she yes, is very, very safe. Because that are clients, that are sisi wenye view your viewers mm. will see ai huyu ana work for just for money. This yes. thing is not working. Yes. She just ni ni mentioning it because she has been paid. You know kitambo ndio watu hakujua about influencing yeah. they got. Yeah. Actually oh, most yeah. of the people oh, when we started with you. When Why? people when we were starting with you people thought that uh you purchased uh the items yes. for me then my my disciples they didn't know it's a it's a way of marketing yeah. so yeah. even for kanye I I I love what you've said. Keep those reservations for you because mm-hmm. those reservations are so good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, even sure. us with brands we tell people I don't want to keep on hoping. I don't want to keep mm-hmm. on yes. hoping around. Mm-hmm. So yeah. if I believe in this brand, give mm-hmm. me time. Mm-hmm. I sample this brand. Mm-hmm. If I believe also let's have work long term yes. yeah. for believability at least ni sikange leo nisema jana ulisema sele. Then look una tunza kutuambia mtu mwingine. So sometimes you need skin care. But I understand the flip side. I feel like the current influencer market I feel like there's a lot of money that skimmed them on top by agencies and they don't really pay people like, mm-hmm. fully their worth. Mm-hmm. So I get those influencers who like this is how they pay rent. So mm-hmm. if this is company has come to date, yeah. so I got to pay the they bills, man. Maybe so yeah. I'll take yeah. yeah. it down yeah. 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 Also, yeah. company. Maybe we are coming exactly. from a point of uh, yeah, maybe a bit privilege. Yeah. privilege. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, you can say mm-hmm. no mm-hmm. to some and say yes to yeah. some. Yeah. Yeah. There's also that. Some people mm-hmm. are not there yet. So yeah. I think with certain things brands should also pay for exclusivity True. you know you work with a brand they tell you don't post it on for six months and they're not paying yes. you yes. for the six, for the six yes. months to be exclusive yeah. to how you that how do you post for them without them paying you first no what well, first of all <laughs> so they pay you after three months which actually they do brands i sometimes really they pay your payment for yeah. six months. it is only you who pays at you are the only yeah, people <laughs> Like I even pay before even I delivered. I mean, the first day my work to with her, uh-huh. I was like cuz okay, it's something I used to do. Maybe now I'm learning to maybe do take a deposit and then mm-hmm. clear the balance mm-hmm. cuz uh, in the beginning I was like no, don't send the money. Me want to go first and yeah. then I know you're happy, then you can pay. Me I'm mm-hmm. never in that. Who you? By the way, I don't know why I'm did you never find a story. Hata before you send me yes, there's money in your phone. <laughs> I don't hurry you by the way take your time because when I give you time to mm. to 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 create the content for me you'll you'll have you you you'll just you yeah, yeah and it will come out nicely and that's the reason why by the way huh? like, working with her content is it's, just crazy it's, it's, like na postingi tu because nyarira she might pay me today mm. and i might post a story two weeks later mm. and i don't but mind. she believes I you don't. know What the best, the yes, best yes. Mm-hmm. and it's the same thing with Dr. Wanza like we've created magic with Dr. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Wanza so, yeah. Yeah. so you really are work. amazing clients yes. thank you and you're amazing yeah i'm looking uh, for money to also be a client <laughs> <laughs> you also a client yeah. <laughs> because by the way you are easy mm-hmm. yeah. i know <laughs> <laughs> anyway ladies anyway, yeah. like i must bring you back here because i feel mm. this is a so conversation bad. that needs mm. to continue and especially by the way so have we thanked you fast before you oh, yeah. oh okay 
<laughs> you also good by the way because uh, I get some so many so many comments about when the clients come to the shop they mm-hmm. always say hey kina judi na wakavinye ah those are the people now to work with those people we respect them so much mm-hmm. actually by the way your brand is so respected out there by the way because I think of the way you, you're genuine yeah. and then you are you are you are authentic yani muna tupeanga ile 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 ni ile yeah yeah so that's what people by they love mm. view out there for because of being authentic or the yeah. authentic authentic exactly. and uh, and any yani, night kuna jina nilikuwa natumia hapo ya kishengi hivi yani sema 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 tena na iko na potea yeah so i think that you're good by the way your blood is good out there they are good actually i i can they are good they are good so she and then you you are so easy to talk to asante how skill uko hapa nyi mko hapa so easy so watu wasiwaogope watu wasiwaogope thank you okay the power of content in business in the current market maybe we can touch on that yeah like the power of content even when it doesn't directly direct your clients to your business there is sometimes i see clients who was spoken to by content that I did long before yes. I started the practice. Yeah. So I feel like it would really help businesses if you just like just have the page, mm-hmm. create the content mm-hmm. because when you treat people you're trying to sell to as smart people, mm-hmm. when you're creating this content for them, you're creating content because you know they can consume it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Just treat people as smart. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uyo, uyo mtu anakuja kubai tu just just treat them as smart they know what you sure. they know they can hear what you're saying mm. they know what you're doing content just creating content will yeah. give you more business mm. than an ad that will yeah, be trying sure. to direct people yeah, sure. to that business because yeah. actually I can't provide value uh, if i come mm. across a, an, a, an ad Mm-hmm. then in the kwa page yako i see you've not posted anything you have like two posts three yeah. posts mm-hmm. i wouldn't take you seriously That's true. actually That's and good. then another thing you have to use money to make money the way i was telling mm-hmm. you people are uh, ananiuliza kai you pay all that money to mm-hmm. to them and then you you also give them the items to post mm-hmm. hi i can't <laughs> so you have to use money to make money mm-hmm. and you have to let it go don't send and then you keep on holding it back yeah. it's like you're depending on that money so much in a way a key post ukose kuuza you give up ama you start sure. talking badly mm-hmm. you should not do that cuz she's not god or she's not god mm-hmm. you have to let it go just do your part and mm-hmm. then cuz every yeah. time i send you money by the i always pray for it mm-hmm. naambia mungu wacha mapenzi yako yafanyike yes. you are the one to bring clients you are the one to make them see that post and like my product yeah. so you just send and leave it to do it that's work. and yeah. as uh, dr wanza was saying sometimes that client may not come at that time yeah yeah sure yeah, they must be the post by the they way. won't come at that mm. time. Yes, they yeah. may come to, they, they may come one month two months mm. two days mm. three days mm. down the line yeah sure so that is still conversion mm. that is still a client mm. who came because they saw something they liked on yeah. my page yeah. so mm. they followed him Maybe so I, uh, kusa, yeah, you they may they not get the business. the results mm-hmm. at that and moment. That time, yeah. Yeah. But now but eventually it will come. Because yeah. kama nikiona kitu kama umepost and I don't have that money, obviously I, I won't buy. Yeah. I mm. might save it and come buy it later when I have money. Yeah. Even to fund the Aiki. Um thank you for having us mm-hmm. and thank you for you know bringing these amazing conversations to people. Yeah. Um, I keep saying we don't see enough women who look like us talking about business. Yeah. Um yeah and if we want to start a business imagine just start yeah. I always say and actually this is not slander but you know if McDonald's can t- t- sell food that tastes like plastic you can sell anything literally <laughs> <laughs> so uh, but it's just to say if you look around you yeah. there's somebody who knows less than you has mm-hmm. less resources mm-hmm. than you and is doing it yeah. so like anybody anywhere can start yeah. and do it mm-hmm. yeah Wow. Mm. Make sure you've learned you've, you've done your due diligence and mm. a bit of research before you start that. Yeah, topic. sure. Mm. This is where na. Yeah. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> but you've done a mm-hmm. great job. Yes. yes. Let me say something. Yeah. Quick. Mm. You know sometimes we've grown up hearing these clichés like work hard, just mm. start. Mm. Mm. 
those cliches are cliches for a reason. It's because they work. Mm-hmm. Hard work pays. It will pay. Yeah. Like those That's cliches true. of just starting. Listen to your customer. Take the feedback. Mm-hmm. It is not always easy. You see those little things mm-hmm. that we keep hearing we've had growing up. It's because they work and they also work in business. That's true. And they love to do and learn. Mm-hmm. Business is also not easy. It's not easy. Mm-hmm. It's not easy. <laughs> like the future has to go in. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Go in no, <laughs> but it's not easy. Yeah. Uta yeah. struggle. Iyo na yo mtu asikudanganye. Even when you're making money, uta mm. struggle. Yeah. At some point, the bills will overwhelm. Mm. Yeah, so it's not easy, but you don't give up. Mm-hmm. Don't yes. give up. Yeah. And cliches are cliches for a reason. They work hard work. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. They work. Guy, I will bring you guys back for another conversation. I feel we still a lot we haven't yeah. covered. Yeah. Yes, but thank you so much, co-hosts. Mm. You are welcome. Are we giving back? I was thinking give it to you. Are we giving up? No, we are not. We are not. We are coming up. back and you will yes. see us. <laughs> yes. Soon. Soon. Get serious. Edition 2. <laughs> <laughs> And our company is Tumus, Tumus, Tumus Ventures. Ask us. Oh, Why Tumus. Tumus? You know, two B and 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 because they are the bright, they are our brightest shining stars. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And then of course the company had a combination of both names. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, well, that's how we name our business. Well. <laughs> 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 yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Guys, yeah. ladies and gentlemen, it was a pleasure. Thank mm-hmm. you so much. You've sat here. Of course, if one can have a camera, I'm a stretch. Hey, guys and gentlemen, it's back. It's back. See you. Bye. 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 Bye